Azerbaijani soldiers have tortured and killed 19 Armenian POWs. Armenian civilians and servicemen have continued to be captured by Azerbaijan during the second war that broke out in Artsakh on September 27th and after the signing of the trilateral ceasefire statement on November the 9th of last year. Armenian human rights activist Ardax Enalyan wrote on his Facebook that out of the people who found themselves in captivity, 19 of them have been tortured and killed by Azerbaijani servicemen. The study of the collected videos and photos shows that the tortures, cruelties and inhuman treatment by the Azerbaijani by Johnny Armed Forces against Armenian POWs have been committed with motives of ethnic hatred, noted the human rights defender of Armenia, Armand Tatoyan. Azerbaijanis have removed the domes of the Holy Savior Khazan Chetsot's Armenian Cathedral in Shushi in Agorna Karabakh, which has been handed over to Azerbaijan following the war back in the fall of 2020. Azerbaijan cannot restore the cultural value of a nation against which it has been spreading systematic hatred at the state level for years, said Artsa State Service for Emergency Situations official Hunan Tadevosyan. U.S. President Joe Biden has authorized the provision of military aid to Azerbaijan, which was initially limited due to the conflict between Baku and Armenia and tensions over the disputed territory of Nagorno-Karabakh, The Hill reported. Secretary of State Anthony Blinken confirmed that such assistance to Azerbaijan would not undermine or hamper ongoing efforts to negotiate a peaceful settlement between Armenia and Azerbaijan or be used for offensive purposes against Armenia. This decision proves condemnation of the American Armenian community as a betrayal after Biden's historic decision to formally recognize the Armenian genocide. Former Chief of the General Staff of the Armed Forces of Armenia, Colonel General Moses Hagopian, has been questioned and subsequently charged by the National Security Service. Hagopian noted that he has been charged for disclosing of information containing state secrets. As of Tuesday morning, 399 new cases of COVID-19 were confirmed in Armenia and the total number of these cases has reached 217,407 in the country. Also, 16 more deaths from the coronavirus were registered, making the respective total 4,165 cases. The number of people who have recovered over the past one day is 635, and the total respective number so far is 201,107.